What's up guys and welcome to another Utter Shite. Now a lot of you guys have not heard of the Utter Shite playlist so you should check out some more of them videos. But <clears throat> this is Arctic Trucker Simulator. Uh, these, this is the word, okay, exactly from the, um, the Keymailer website. Okay, so it says Arctic Truck Simulator officially endorsed by Alex Deborski takes you down the world's icest and most dangerous roads. Do it like Alec Deborski, the most popular ice road trucker ever. Get in your truck, start the engine, and transport massive cargoes over the snowy transport routes of the Arctic. Machines, wood, and bulk solids, blah, 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 blah. Key features here. Five trucks with varying power and traction. Career mode with a points multiplier. Improved service and change the look of your truck. Dynamic weather system in numerous settings. Support steering wheels and game pads. Look at that, and the music's restarted. Fucking amazing. Right, well, without further ado... We should just get into it. So, let's um, um, press F3 and set up the road train. You say the road train. I mean, it's not really a road train, is it? You're just transporting some other fucking stuff just around the, the hooji thingies. So, there we go. Let's let's start this. Now, we don't have a lot of diesel. Um, not really much you can do about that. Not sure what this does. Absolutely nothing, apparently. The music is really fucking loud. Okay, so, I mean, let's let's go. Do you want to see the interior of the truck? It's fucking fantastic, guys. Look at this. This is what... this is. These are kind of edge graphics you want on a simulator. They've spent... Like, the trees, admittedly, actually look quite nice. What the hell is this over here? Is this Mr. Dubofsky's house? I don't even know. But that, that fucking turn insert it just turns just instantly. It's like a go-kart. I'm about to run out of diesel too. Isn't that fucking amazing? So you you get the drift, guys. You you're in your truck. Really quite fucking maneuverable, actually. Yeah, uh, we need to go right here, don't we? Better check, make sure there's no other cars coming. Because otherwise we could squash somebody. Look at that, there's even a fallen tree on the wayside. At least the mirrors the mirrors work really, really good. What the hell is this called? A, a, a what an Atticus. The fuck is an Atticus? And how I'm I've run out of gas and we're charged a thousand dollars for an emergency thing. Okay, cool. Uh do we have some lights? Brilliant lights, guys. Fuck. See, so if you want to go waste some money on a Arctic truck simulator, boy, this is your shit right here. This is what you want to fucking be spending your money on. Um, if not, I'd probably go to Burger King or something and buy, like, a burger. Because you're probably going to get more value out of it. Um, now, not to hate on the game. Um, I did get the key for free. Um, but I'm not gonna sort of sugarcoat it and say, oh, you should definitely check this this game out um, Because it's shit It's shit. I'm literally bored There's nothing to look at The steam rule is No The gauges don't even work apparently I'm not even moving Which is of course good. It's definitely what you want out of your Arctic truck simulator you know, for it to not actually simulate real life stuff. Well done there, guys. Oh, there's a thing up there. Can I squash it? I mean, if my truck could go over 30, I probably could do. Let's try and hit it. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm in the, uh... I'm in the... Fine. You know what? Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Come on. You can run to me, mate. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, fuck you. Shit, I actually hit it. What the hell? Uh, is it? Where's it gone? It's just disappeared, yeah? Fantastic. That's... That's really good there, guys. Good job. Right, well, as you, uh... As you can see, we've all gotten stage 5 cancer from watching this. Um, it's already... It's 6 minutes into the recording, and I already want to just quit this. But you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try and sort of see what the unloading procedure is like. Why are my lights not even working? How fucking shit is this? 
Well, I mean, we're almost there. So, hopefully we can do... Oh, look at that. We've got a light over there. Fuck. Wow. Really? So I don't have to unload it or nothing? I just drive, drive there. It unloads it for me. And then I drive home, yeah? That's what you're saying. So it looks like it is to me. And I can't even drive any faster. I mean, surely there must be something to customise the cab with. You know, maybe a half-decent interior. Or something like that. Just saying. Maybe. Look at this. This, fu this fucking truck. Just, this whole game just sucks. It's a money grab. Oh, look at that. We've hit 50 miles an hour. I wonder what happens if we hit this, like... Oh, oh, no, we're slamming back down again. I wonder what happens if we hit this. Huh. Okay. Cool. Well, it's a good job that that's there, then. To definitely stop us from... So, I mean... How hard is it to, like, make a no-collide box or something like that? What's the, what's the refueling like then? That might be a bit more realistic. Probably not. You probably just have to, like, drive there and you just, you don't even have to stop. It just fills you up straight away. Just like insta-fuel. Man, that should be a fucking thing. Don't go out to your car, just look, click your fingers and it's full up. God damn. Oh, okay, no, you, you do actually have to stop. Well, fucking shit. Literally no money whatsoever. So, um, good luck trying to recover that money off of me. I literally don't want to drive home. I just want to close the fucking, close the fucking game down and just uninstall it. I guess it was kind of a mistake to give me a key for this because if your game is shit, I'm going to tell you that it's shit. So they probably just send me decent games. Or well, shit games, I mean... I'll play pretty much anything. But like I said, if it's crap, you guys are gonna get called the fuck out on it. What a fucking... It's disgusting, isn't it? I'm saying just, okay, make a bog standard, like, flat surface, slap some fucking textures on it, boom, job done. I'm just gonna say... Euro Truck Simulator. That is a proper simulator. Not none of this fucking Arctic Alex Borbachev, whatever his fucking name is, from Ice Road Truckers. You're endorsing junk, mate. You can't be that hard up if you're on TV delivering fucking stuff, mate. I'm just saying. So you're just selling the fuck out. Should be ashamed of yourself. Who the fuck even watches Ice Road Truckers anyway? This was just the same shit. Just could be dangerous, man. We could uh, slip onto ass and maybe fall in. Like, yeah, okay, I'll get that. What do you want? Fucking metal. Because if you do, I don't have any. The hell is that fucking. What the hell is. How loud are the fucking crows, mate? Delivery stops. Okay. Press F3 and set up the road train. Oh, shit, look at that. We've got another job. Can we maybe change our truck? Uh, let's have a look at the design, or the shop. You are serious, huh? Okay, so we could purchase the engine. Consumption. I mean, this, this is the worst. Clean anything. Look at that, I've travelled 420. Smoke weed every day. Um, well, there you go, guys. That was ice. A fucking ice trucking simulator. Just don't fucking bother buying it. Straight up, don't bother buying it. Just fucking go get Euro Truck Simulator. Because that game is so much fucking better than this. In fact, I even think big rigs over the road racing is more fun than this. And that's saying something. That is literally the worst game ever made. But with that being said, guys, <laughs> thank you very much for watching. Take care. If you liked it, do not forget to hit that motherfucking like button. Do not forget to subscribe. And of course, share with your nan. Otherwise, your nan is going to have to play this. Uh, and she is, of course, going to just have to go uh, and spend 
200,000 credits on a truck that can pull four trailers. I mean, that's pretty good for four trailers. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Take care. And as always, I'll see you lot next time.